he died very young. And in the field that he's in, he could have, the contributions would have continued and continued and continued. Good morning, Justin. This is your grandfather, Gordon. Your dad has asked me to just uh, give you a few words uh, summarizing maybe my thoughts on life or whatever. He always was questioning, what does this mean? Is there a way to do this better? At the same time, he was very smart. He was very creative. Find your limits and go try and go a little bit beyond, uh, both mentally and physically. I think the combination is, is really good. Gordon's contribution, of course, was in two, at least two sciences. One was in physics, and in particular, what we call elementary particle physics. His other contribution, which started later, was in how the brain works. We'll look upon him as he opened a door, or opened two doors. Can math and music be used in combination in education? All that you have to do is look at the faces of these children that are participating in the program. And they, probably in many cases, at the first time are finding success at something, they really enjoy doing it. He'll be regarded as one of the pioneers. But he always combined it with experiment and measurement, and that's part of his strength. Whether it's uh, um, to do with gardening or uh, astrophysics or uh, politics or uh, helping people or whatever. I think it was his social conscience. Or his, that's what made him so amazing. And that's what led him to start the Mind Institute and to try to develop educational methods that would show results. People want to be part of this. Uh, they want to make a difference in the lives of children, and they want results. But you have to, in the end, demonstrate, as he and his colleagues demonstrated, that they could really show that these children were actually brighter and more creative and learned faster. Well, for me, it was love at first sight. I knew that he had something great going, and I wanted us to be part of that. If you can find something, your passion, that you can find that will also uh, afford you to make a living, then you're, then you're really lucky. Uh, I mean, I was able to do that. He was very excited about it. <laughs> he could talk forever about it. He was very excited that this was a new insight into the, how the brain functions. I was a believer before he even finished his first sentence, so. Uh, finally, if you can uh, leave it a little bit better than you found it, then you've, then you've uh, gone beyond yourself and, and you've, uh, well, I think, will have had a good life. If it wasn't for him, then we wouldn't be having this, this great and wonderful program. I miss Gordon. I, I mean, I wish he was around. I, I would still call him up. I've been thinking about some new things. And you could always get original insight and thoughts about from Gordon. Greatly to be missed, yeah. I hope that stays with you. So good luck and uh, <laughs> see you later. <laughs>